Palace, obviously, culmination of a great career, being recognized here, senior night. What kind of emotions, what kind of thoughts are going through your mind right now? I mean, I'm just really happy to have had a chance to play with the amazing group of girls that, um, you know, these past couple of years, like, I feel really blessed. And um, I just want to thank God, like, um, Coach McEwen took a chance on me, and um, here we are today. And um, this is my last, potentially last home game, and I get to spend it with um, a group of amazing people. So I just feel really blessed. And then I know you hit a thousand rebounds on Thursday, but I wasn't there for that, so I'm gonna ask you about that now. Um, kind of reflecting on that record, what does that mean to you too, as kind of a symbol of what you've been able to do here? Yeah, just to be um, uh, recognized in like the Northwestern um, history books, along with names like Nia Coffey and Anuka Brown and everybody else that has been able to hit that milestone or um, come close to hitting that milestone is huge, and you know um, a lot of people have invested in me to, um, to, to allow me to get to that point. All right, and then Lindsay um, had been, you know, five for 21 last time out and then coming back this time. Was there something that changed or is it just game to game? Sometimes you're hitting shots, sometimes you aren't. Um, I mean, I, my mindset was to come in and be aggressive. Um, my teammates set great screens. I was able to curl and get open shots. Um, they know where I like the ball, so I was just able to get in the rhythm early. And then you guys are obviously going into Iowa for the last game of the season for both of you, but especially Palace. I mean, you guys have had some great battles with that team in the past going up against Gustafson, another great big. Um, what's your mindset going into that game? We're just going to go and try and play Northwestern basketball. I mean, that's, that's really all we can do and um, stick to our principles, follow the scout, and yeah. just play hard. Yeah. <clears throat> Lindsay, what is it about Indiana that you see so much <coughs> success against them? Because once again, you're able to kind of you know, really have your way scoring. Yeah, I, I mean, I don't know. I just get in the rhythm. Um, it just <laughs> happens to be that way. Uh, I think, like, they, they play me so tight that I'm able to curl off screens and um, just get open shots, I mean, create off the dribble. So, I mean, I just get in the rhythm every time it happens to be them. Uh, and what was it like that – you know, in your last game, Palace, um, your last home game, potentially, mm -hmm. uh, the team never trailed and was pretty mm -hmm. dominant against this Indiana team. Yeah, I mean, that just proves what, like, the potential we have to be a great team. We came out strong, and, you know, we were really focused on what we, on what we had to do tonight, and we knew what was at stake. So it was just really, like, amazing to see how we could trust each other and really pull out, pull out a win tonight. House, when you look back at this night, 5, 10, 15 years from now, what will you remember most? I got to look into the future. Uh, <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, I mean, like the people that came out to support me, um, my sister flew in from uh, from Maryland, <coughs> Mobileji Akiode, who um, had actually, um, is the reason I'm, like one of the reasons I'm here today, um, came down to see me, just the first time she seen me play, uh, and... You know, it's just re I just feel really blessed, and I, you know, I hope um, we can go on to uh, at least like do get, do big things in the tournament, in the Big Ten tournament, and uh, yeah, finish the season strong. Um, Twenty-two assists today, and I think only like six turnovers. How were you able to take such good care of the basketball and and find each other for open looks? Um, I think we really did what, what we like to do. We didn't let Indiana dictate to us. We dictated to them, and we, we ran our offense how we, how we practice, and we, were, we just had the mentality that we were going to control the game. Yeah, and what was the key to breaking that, that press that Minnesota used in, in previous games so effectively but didn't seem to stop you today? Um, just being poised. Uh, I think sometimes we get rushed. We were just able to take our time, uh, make the passes that we wanted to make, and just read their defense. Thank you. Thank you.